Today I'm out here in Penn, Saskatchewan at our Liberty Link product knowledge plot. The reason I'm out here today is I was given a heads up about some premature ripening in some of the plots so I wanted to find out what was going on. So what I'm in right now, this is the dividing line here between two different hybrids. On this side is a Liberty Link hybrid that does not have sclerotinia tolerance in it and on this side is P505 MSL which has clubbit resistance in it but it's also got some sclerotinia tolerance and there's definitely a difference between pre premature ripening between the two hybrids here so when I go into the canopy on the one where we have some premature ripening I'm definitely seeing some plants here that are quite discolored you can see a lesion at the bottom of this plant here and it's all hollow the stem shouldn't be able to shred like that at this time of year. You can see a bit of a sclerotinia, probably sclerotinia infection here that would have been started. This plant over here again is all hollow on the bottom. So what I'm going to do from here is pull about 100 plants in this plot and pull 100 in that plot and I'm going to do some readings. And so while I'm out here doing some sclerotinia readings, I'm going to take a look for any signs of black leg. I'm also going to look for club root, not that I'm overly concerned about it, but it's the perfect time of year to be scouting for, for all of those diseases, for club root, for sclerotinia, and for black legs. So stay tuned and I'll show you what I'm finding for a sclerotinia infection.